Today, we're going to take a sneak peek inside my medicine cabinet and see what I consider to be my top 10 emergency survival essential oils. Lavender has to be at the top of my list. It's like the Swiss army knife of oils. It's healing for burns, cuts, and bruises. It helps to reduce anxiety and stress. It's soothing for sunburns. It can help with earaches. It helps prevent bug bites. It can kill lice. It's an all-natural antihistamine. And it even helps relieve insomnia lemon essential oil. I use it on a daily basis. It's an excellent disinfectant. It has antiseptic properties. It soothes sore throats. It helps to battle colds and flu. It helps to get rid of intestinal parasites. It eases gout symptoms and it even helps your digestive system. Peppermint is another must-have essential oil. It helps to increase focus and alertness. Make sure to stick it in the diffuser for after school homework sessions. It's good for nausea and digestive upsets. It eases muscle aches. It has antibacterial properties. It helps to soothe allergies and can even help reduce fevers. And it makes an excellent headache reliever. As a migraine sufferer, I wouldn't be without it. Oregano isn't just for pizzas. It's also very effective at treating bacterial and fungal infections. It reduces inflammation. It reduces the size of warts and skin tags. It aids in cleansing the GI tract. And it relieves joint and back pain. Melaleuca is also known as tea tree oil. It makes an excellent first aid ointment. It soothes skin irritations such as eczema, athlete's foot, and psoriasis. It supports the immune system. It protects the respiratory system. And it heals bug bites. Helichrysum is kind of like nature's band-aid. It soothes bruises, sprains, and reduces swelling. It fights bacterial and viral infections. It helps with wound healing. It reduces the pain associated with broken bones, wounds, and bruises. And it even helps reduce bleeding. Myrrh is one of the three gifts that the wise men brought to the baby Jesus and his mother. It's easy to see why. Myrrh essential oil stimulates the immune system increases blood circulation. It promotes regeneration of tissues. It is astringent and antiseptic. It has analgesic properties. It eases the swelling of cuts, wounds, or bruises, and it helps to reduce infections. When I think of clove, I think about baking, but it's so much more than that. Clove essential oil helps to relieve toothache pain. It's good for headaches. It has antibiotic properties. It has analgesic properties. It can relieve nausea and constipation and helps to eliminate toxins. Frankincense is another essential oil that is truly fit for a king. It works with the other essential oils to enhance their effects. It helps to reduce inflammation it's good for headaches. It supports skin tissue healing. It soothes hyperactivity and restlessness and helps with focus and clear thinking. Lemongrass essential oil rounds out my top 10. It's an effective bug repellent. It soothes aching sore muscles. It has a warming effect which is so nice in winter and it assists with cleansing. Make sure to tell me in the comments below if you think there's anything I forgot to add to this list. And as always, I would love it if you would subscribe. 
Don't forget to check out our June giveaway. Have a blessed day.